Okay, this is Microvision's laser Pico projector, the Show WX, which just came to market in the US in March of 2010. And I am here to demo uh, how to correct what some reviews refer to as a slight pincushion or bow tie effect that you'll notice on projected images, uh, particularly when projecting next to a straight edge. Here at the bottom of the image, you'll see a straight uh, level. And you may notice that there's a slight bowing of the middle of the photograph just above that straight edge. In Photoshop, there is a utility or tool called Lens Correction, which can readily correct for this. And I will show you a few demos here. This is here uh, incrementally. Uh, all right, so this now shows the corrected photo. Now, as you'll see, the, the image is now perfectly parallel with the level. Um, any bowing you see at this point would be distortion in the videotaping itself. Okay, a few more examples. All right. Uh, one thing I notice is that when watching videos, uh, this pincushion effect is still present, but I do not notice it at all, or at least not, uh, my eye doesn't go to it at all when watching videos. Um, and, uh, if it was an issue for videos, uh, I, for some people, I believe that it would be fairly straightforward to create a post-processing um, software that would correct for that. Anyone who converts their DVDs or videos to their mobile devices um, already uses software to convert the video files anyway, and this would be just another easy step to, uh, to do. Okay. Okay, this is final example. This is uncorrected and corrected. And now, if uh, anyone wishes to see step-by-step uh, -step in Photoshop, I'm going to demonstrate that. Hooking my VGA doc uh, into my laptop here. And let's drag Photoshop over to the monitor. Okay, uh, this is Photoshop CS, and what I'm simply doing here now is, this is an unedited version. What I first do is duplicate layer, and uh, then we are going to increase the canvas size, and here, uh, I need to increase the canvas size by a certain percentage. We're going to go 105% increase in width and height, making sure that the canvas extension color is black. There we go. And now we're going to go to Filters, Distort, Lens Correction. And unfortunately, this screen doesn't pop up on your on the projector, but uh, under this. Uh, lens distortion filter, I am going to cre uh, cre go to remove distortion and set remove distortion to minus five. And I'm clicking OK. And what that you can see does is it created a little bit of a bowing uh, in the image. And we now go to layer. Flatten layer and save. And uh, now you can save to whatever uh, folder you're choosing and put on your mobile device or device for projecting. Uh, you can also create an action like I have done and with just a couple clicks of a button, convert as many photos or images as you like uh, to get this effect. Um, that could be particularly useful. Uh, especially for business presentations, if you want everything to look exactly perfect for an uh, important presentation, you could correct this uh, with uh, fair ease. Okay, thanks for watching.